and Nadia's father plays the trumpet. And when I heard that track in the outro with Nadia's father playing on the outro, I was like, I was like, this is what I want to do. This is what I'm going to pursue. So, like how do you know how does it to help everyday life, you know, how to that what does it do for you like how does it make you put you in a level up kind of way? Okay. Uh I I live a I live a moment to moment. And that's, that's, that's music to me. Music doesn't stop. If you listen to a track, it doesn't have clicks, mistakes. It just goes. It's a progression. It's beautiful. And that's how I treat life. It's just one beautiful progression of positive moments. That's how I live my life. So does music help you escape? Does it help you, you know what I mean? So, like, you know, when, when do you reach out to music? You know, like, what's the state of for me, music is an escape. Uh, it take, I, I don't have to take, I just listen and vibe, and it takes me away to another dimension. And it's a good dimension. Music is a great dimension to be in. It's a great thing to be in. I try to be in. I don't even watch TV. I just listen to music in my chair. I listen to the vinyl. It's great. So, um, I know we were talking earlier and you were saying that, you know, you have a, uh, an album that's been working on, and it's not going to take time to release it. So, you know, tell us a little bit about that project. Right, well, my first, uh, EP, no, I'll be the first one, right? I did an EP back in January called The Magician. It was only three tracks. I did a cover of a B point song called I Can Hear Music, which is very important to me. That's called I Can Hear Music, which is a raw next tune that Phil Spector originally wrote. Um, and I uh, did another track that we did a full drum song. But regardless, that album called The Magician made me open my eyes to what I could actually go into the studio and really do. Because my real EP that I'm about to be dropping soon and recording is called. Uh, the Alchemist, which is all about change and uh, changing the world, opening eyes back to jazz music. It's going to be a jazz album, heavily jazz, heavy percussion, with a lot of different instruments that I'm bringing up into the studio. We're going to have saxophones, uh, cellists, flutes, we're going to have uh, trombones, trumpets, people on trumpets, all kinds of things. Uh, drum circles, all kinds of things. I, I just, it's all up in my head. And I'm not writing a damn note. It's all going to be me bringing, it's all going to be completely organic. We're bringing everybody up into the studio, regardless of your talent. And we're going to bring, we're going to bring that jazz soul into this, into the spirit of this album. So, um, how did you know that the jazz project come about? That, you know, what inspired uh, you to want to do the EP and EP? Uh, I just told myself, what am I waiting for? I got this skill, this, I got to do it. I got to do it, and I'm ready to do it. I got my chops up. I'm in a band. I go to open mics. I keep my chops up. I keep mentally sharp. Fluid, sharp on the, you know, on my, on my, on my uh, dexterities and all that shit. And what, what's the name? <laughs> It's time, it's time right now, um, because I saw, okay, honestly I'm doing it because I don't want to go to a studio and have somebody turn it off for me. I want to turn it down and off for myself and make it perfect and make it as dope as possible. So that's why I'm trying to go. I'm ready, I got my studio set up. We're going to be recording in less than, less than two weeks. We're going to be recording the first track. So. It, it, we already have a release date. It's uh, January 25th. I'm sorry, January 5th, 2025 is when we're going to release it. I don't know what that is. I just like doing that. So, uh, 
where will we be able to hear CP's uh, live you know, live show on the radio? Yeah, we're going to be on the radio and we're going to be on the radio and we're going to be on the radio. We're going to be on the radio and 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 we're going to we are here doing the double with a couple of interviews, he's recording live as well, and he's doing it myself. So, uh, you heard it here first, on both clips, both, both interviews, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, I can't wait to, uh, you know, that interview with Alex Bell, and then we're going to hear, you know, the skill set, and, you know, what he's been working on. Uh, Alex, you know, just give a little bit for you, bro. Yeah, absolutely. I'm going to give you a little bit. So, you know, we're going to be, um, you know, be on the lookout for projects, you know, how to like the CD, doing some of my things. Um, definitely got some projects coming out, we need to do that here, but of course we already got to save pay, like I've been running for a long time already. So, um, you know, he's going to uh, plug in some of the stuff that you get to find out and, you know, the project probably never gets done. Alright, well, we're LLC and uh, Manic Medicine, we're doing Thank you. 